there's another dude that way. Which means there's got to be something up here. No? Nothing? How did all those people die? Oh, there's a path down there. There's a secret down that way. Oh, no. Okay, well, now we're going to have to see how these guys work. Okay. And then this dude... What's he gonna do? Is that like a poison mist? It is. It's a poison mist. Don't do it. Don't do it. Out of range. Okay, cool. So, keep an eye out here. There are a couple spots you can drop down. Okay, will do. Keep my eyes out. All right, cool. But for now, we move forward. Like how, uh, I like how I'm not even like fighting these guys that <laughs> properly. I'm just refusing to. And there's something over there. Waiting for one of them to like drop down on me. All right. This sweeps around over this way. Brigand axe. I don't like that you're walking towards me. Oh, this is uh, Mildred. Bye. Butcher's knife. Nice. Praise the I did it. <laughs> Oh, well, we're not using her weapon, though. We're using the Great Machete. What's her weapon? Now it's just a regular axe. That's yeah, not even that cool. Is this a trap? No jumping ahead? What does that mean? Brigand twin daggers? Huh? Oh, dude. That's kind of neat. How impractical is that to use, though, in a fight? We really need to get 24 strength so we can sit there and run this thing with one hand. Are dual swords any good? I guess those were daggers, but you know what I mean. Okay, so there's a dude over there. There's a way up here. You're not dead. Nope. I'm gonna go through this whole area and hopefully never fight one of these guys like I'm supposed to. That's my goal. Nice. Dark Souls 3 introduced dual weapons. Yeah, it looks like it. It's actually kind of neat. So apparently, I, I did a little bit of looking up on what that screen, like the frame dropping was. Ooh, I don't know about that one. <laughs> oh gosh. Here we go. Well. Do we go down that way or deal with the dude summoning a bunch of poison clouds? Let's head down. Let's see what we can't find down here. Duo ahead, huh? Oh, it's a dog. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, don't do it. Oh, no, don't do it. No, don't do it. Heal. Heal. We're good. Oh, that was, uh, that was close. Braille Divine Tome of Kareem. Isn't that what one of the dudes was from Kareem or something like that? Something like that. It's a key item. Learn high miracles. Okay. So yeah, we're going to need to use that at some point, I'm guessing. Morn's ring. Braille tones can be given to the blind lady. Oh, okay. We have two dark sigils now. I don't know how that works. Is that just the amount of free levels we can get? Also, we have hollowing four. <laughs> what does that mean? Should be like a help button. Oh, hey. Oh, God. My man came all the way down here just to kill me. The character will turn hollow if the curse grows too severe. Well, I don't want to turn hollow. We're going to need to find a way to break the curse. Unless us leveling up does make us become more hollow from the dude's free levels. Which could be a thing. Oh, this is just the other side. Ah! That's nice. There's a dude back here, too. Hey, man. Surprise! An ember. Nice. Is there anything? Nah, we good, we good. You die, you get hollowing levels. Certain points, you get more dark sigils that give you hollowing per death, profit free levels. <laughs> uh, so what you're saying is hollows are something that, uh, or hollowing is something that I don't want because technically I get levels from that. Uh, these guys okay? Guys, I'm just gonna light this real quick. Thanks, gentlemen. What can I help you with? Oh, hello. How do you do? Oh, you're a woman. Never mind. <laughs> I am Anri of Astora, unkindled like you. This is Horace, a friend and traveling companion. Are you too? You can't really tell in armor, something? to be fair. <laughs> we are well along the road of sacrifices. Below us is the crucifixion woods. Beyond the flooded woods lies Farron Keep, home of the undead legion. Further yet is the Cathedral of the Deep. We seek the cathedral, home of the grim Aldrich. We may go our separate ways now, but we are both seekers of lords. The next time we cross paths, one may find the other in a time of need. Seems like... Flames guide your way. It seems like they're telling me that uh Oh yes, Horace. We're gonna <laughs> He's not very talkative. I haven't tried to talk to him yet, but, but uh okay. Him. He's an upstanding, kind hearted knight, a fine partner for this grueling journey. Without his help, I would have cursed this onerous duty long ago. We are well along the road beyond we make the next day. Okay. I'm guessing you don't talk at all? <sighs> Okay. <laughs> I'm just gonna start. <laughs> Let's start talking to people like that. Just every time. I wonder how many souls this gives us. Hold on. Because I, if I can buy the tower key, I want to go do that. Seems like a cool trick. Hmm. You're an unkindled, aren't you? I am Sirius of the Sunless Realms. Okay. I'm a servant of the divinity. Where did you come from? Duties we each bear, but one's duty is a solitary affair. I doubt we've much to gain from fraternization. 
blessing of the moon upon your journey. Okay. I doubt we've much to bless. So you're just chilling out talking then, huh? Okay. Now you said we can sell them to her, so maybe we can find out. Knowest thou of that soppy gossip? Hold on. That cordial intrusion layeth the path to embers. And so thou art in need of a soapstone, ashen oh. one. Then so we my get pockets the... will overflow with souls to trade to me. This is how we get the soapstone? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not. Ashen one, bring me with, is it not? <laughs> okay, so... Oh, it's only 3,000 souls worth? That's 10,000. We can almost get there. Almost. I don't want that. Take that. Actually, take all of this stuff. I'm not using any of this stuff. Scythe would be kind of cool, but I don't think we're going to go with the scythe build. Functions as a headshot, inflicting heavy damage. Not gonna do Sastis either. I'm gonna I'm gonna keep the scythe for a little bit, for for a little while. All right, just for a little while. Okay, we actually might be able to buy this stuff. Sells for five hundred. Really happy you're actually able to sell this stuff. <laughs> I'm gonna keep the twin daggers because they're kind of cool. What is this? Increases poise while casting miracles. Okay. Wooden shield. Not keeping one of each weapon, you heathen. Listen, man, I got better things to do, okay? Then keep everything. So we got so many workers garbs, man. Okay, we might be able to buy it now. That boost miracles, which we're never going to use. We can sell this for a thousand, but I don't want to because Ziegward gave it, or Ziegward gave us that. Or transpose, yeah. <clears throat> we don't care about transposing it. I didn't see anything I wanted from it. So does this give us just 3,000, same amount? Okay, so it does give us the same amount. That's kind of nice. I still don't think we're going to have enough. Oh, we're a 1,000 off. <laughs> um... What can we sell for a thousand? Let's sell one of these. We got we got a bunch of them, so whatever. And we can buy a whole bunch more, so that'll be fine. Engrave key is fifteen hundred. Interesting. Okay. Let's go see what's in the tower now. Now here's the thing. I forgot how to get there. Uh, I think we have to go up and around outside again, and we have to go. Oh, that's right. This is all janky. You gotta, like, do something here. Welcome home, sweet. Farewell, honey. That work? I forget how to open that. <laughs> you just need to wait. Okay. You haven't given up. You. Oh, a heavy gem. Okay. Not now. I've flown the coop. <laughs> this guy. The undead legion of Farum is a caravan of undead, sworn by wolf's blood to contain the abyss, 
the Legion will bury a kingdom at the first sign of exposure. Joyous bunch, really. Gaining admission to the Legion is a matter of some ceremony. Inside their keep, snuffing out the flames of three altars, opens the door to the wolf blood. Even a cursed undead want to believe they're special. Okay, so that sounds like it's going to be a hint that I we need to sit the there and, souls. like, <laughs> close three, or not close, but turn off three of those things. Snuff the flames. There it is. Okay, now, that way was blocked, I think. I don't think we can get in there, but I think we were supposed to be able to go up here, was it? Isn't there a dog over here, too? There he is. <laughs> I seem to have gone wrong. Or was it in the... I might have been... Inside. I think it was inside. I think it was up this way, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is, this is feeling familiar. Yeah, here we go. Nice. Are you grown yet? Nah. It's a shame. Nice. Okay, now we can go up into the tower. Hopefully this was worth 20,000 souls, because... Dang, we sold almost everything we owned to get here. <laughs> so we can definitely drop down onto there, because there's an item over there. But we're going to go over here first. Hello! goes up okay 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 it goes way up this looks like there's an item over here if I go this way there better be an item I feel it I feel it oh no <laughs> Oh, fury and sadness indeed. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Wasted all that time coming over here. Maybe all the way back. Ah, the tower key. Spent 20,000 souls to get nothing. Hmm. Ooh, a firekeeper soul. Wait, can I give that to that one person? Who is wanting to become a firekeeper? Preserves the bonfire and serves as champions. Okay. Would I be able to give this to uh, the cleric? Or do I need it for something else? You can also drop from where the elevator goes down. What do you mean? Like, are you talking about outside? Oh, I see it. Hmm. That looks like that's gonna hurt on the way down. <laughs> Oh, here we go. <laughs> Alright, we're going to do this right. I missed it. <laughs> no, I landed it. God, I'm good. Firekeeper stuff. Okay. Nice. Are these all fire keepers? An Estus ring. Oh, and this is where he was at. Okay. What does an Estus ring do? Okay. I kind of figured, but I wasn't sure. Gives us more health for Estus. 
It's not a bad idea. Let's put our armor back on, please. <laughs> I think we had to wear that for now. And then this had to be the worker garb. Gauntlets. And then what? These were like... Definitely not the loincloth. Um, now nah, something's off. How's our... No, we can still fast roll. Never mind, we're good. Never mind, we're good. Nice. Okay, back in we go. I think we're up too high. We are up too high. Good this way, here we go. Okay, now we can drop back down to the roof up top and get some more things. So am I right about the uh, the Firekeeper Soul Gilded, about giving it to the Cleric? Or is that something I can give to the main, main chick? Okay, here we go. Ah, they're shiny back there. Okay. Here we go. Think you can give it to the main firekeeper? Okay, that's kind of what I was thinking, but I wasn't sure. Now that we have that kicked down, let's, uh, let's look around this thing a little bit. I don't think there's anything up here that we can get that would be all that useful. There is a way back there. Which looks like it probably leads on to... Oh, hey! You, you. Me, me, pickled pea. Me, yeah. Me. Bum, ba, rum. The bird. I think we have rubbish that we can give it. Uh, yeah. Here. You, you. Never mind. Okay, well. Well, then what do you want, huh? Uh, do you want uh, vertebra shackle? <laughs> uh, do you want. Uh... I don't know, man. Uh, do you want. Heavy gem. That's what I need to make a heavy weapon, right? Yeah, strength. Okay, we want to put that on our other. We our main weapon. Put one of these down. Do you want that? No. Alright. I don't know what to give them, so we're going to have to come back here later. But that's fine, because we can definitely come back here later. There's an item here. Ooh, Homeward Bones. Nice. Uh, there's an illusory wall on the lower level roof. Is there now? I mean, there's also uh, a completely open... <laughs> oh, another one! Oh, it's above. Okay. An Estus shard. Uh, I'm guessing it's right here. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Where does this go to? Never can be too sure. Covetous Serpent Ring. I think that's to uh, give us more... Uh... Who are you? Is this Lucatil? Mm. No. Unkindled are we? And fast on the trail of the Lords of Scondit. Then these red eyes are for you. Use them to pillage embers and briefly heighten your strength for your duty. What else are unkindled ashes good for? <laughs> Local edgelord. <laughs> Pillage embers for briefly hide what else are unkindled. <laughs> so we've got the 
And man, the gang's all here. We have the depressed guy, we have the edgelord, we got the person that doesn't like speaking to us, even though we know that we're gonna, they're like, they're gonna need our help. Got a little bit of everything going on. Okay, well, you know what? Honestly, this place, not too shabby. Not too shabby. I don't know uh, if it was worth 20000 Let's see what happens when we upgrade the Firekeeper. Okay. There you are. I feel like this is going to hurt too much. Come here, little goblin. Twinkling Titanite. Now well, that's not all that useful to us. We're not using a Twinkling Titanite weapon this time around. Is there something back here? Ooh. Nope. Nice. Cool. Is there anything else up there, Gilded, that you know of? Or is it all pretty much taken care of at this point? I'm guessing the main thing was definitely the Firekeeper soul. So where is she here? Welcome home, my speaker. Yes, I can give it to you. I wonder, hold on. Let me, I wanna go talk to her real quick. I just, I'm just curious if I can give it to her as well. Cause she was wanting to become a Firekeeper and she said that was like now out of reach for her. I just don't remember where she is. That's the, Pyromancy guy. I don't know where she is. Giving it to her has some consequences for the ending. Giving it to the firekeeper? Or giving it to the, uh, the cleric? I don't know where the... I've lost the cleric. <laughs> Braille lady might be outside where the Gundy boss fight was. Hey, welcome. Nice. Do not pick the what is it? She's not back here, is she? Oh, she is. Gundir. Okay. Oh, champ, I was not meant to be a firekeeper. The gods are ever I am yours. Oh, I can give it to her. Divine Tome? She's blind. Bear Lady might be where Gundy boss fight was. Gundir. Oh, I, it looks like I can give it to her. XPD, I have a very important question, and what is that? Welcome to the stream, by the way. Oh, yeah, sure. Why not? Brought me a braille divine tome. Now I can tell new tales of miracles. Tales of the greater miracles can be quite the epics. What fun we will have! <laughs> Okay. So, Gilded, you haven't answered the question. <laughs> Have a uh, does anyone here know how I can properly prepare Weisswurst? Weisswurst? I don't know. I'd say that. So it sounds like a German sausage kind of deal. Uh, I randomly bought a pack of them, and I don't know what to do with them. No, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what that is. What is uh what is it? Is it just like a like a bratwurst kind of deal or what question? Um the you say it has um you say it had consequences if I gave it to her. Is it going to change anything like as if as in like I'm not going to get a boss fight or something or like, what does that mean? 